So we can't sulk about it because we got some more ball to play and play the national championship. So we just got to get ready and you know focus on that. You no, know, it's it's tough losing this this game, but um, the the one that we truly want is is the big one, the, the national championship. One more time from Bridgestone Arena in Nashville. Hey everybody, I'm Patrick Murray. The Vols are the number two seed in the South Region in the NCAA tournament, and they'll play Colgate on Friday in Columbus, Ohio. Here's what the South Region bracket looks like. If Tennessee gets past Colgate, then they would play either Cincinnati or Iowa in the second round. And beyond that, the likely opponents in the Sweet 16 would be Purdue or defending national champion Villanova. And that game would take place in Louisville. On the top part of the bracket, ACC regular season co-champ Virginia is the number one seed, and Big 12 co-champ Kansas State is the four seed. You also have Pac-12 tourney champ Oregon and fellow SEC team Ole Miss. Tennessee will have to get through one of those teams in the Elite Eight to make it to the Final Four. The Vols were expected to make a deep run in the turning last season, but lost in the second round to Cinderella team Loyola Chicago. Get another shot. Um, not many teams get that chance. Some teams consecutively do, but other teams you only get one and done. So um, we have to come in and understand that everybody is playing that way. You're gonna, you might play, play a team full of seniors that is this is your last round, go to get it. And we have to come in prepared and ready to fight and ready to compete because um, now it's it can be all over in just that we know that it can be all over in just one second, one one possession. It can be over just because a dude hits a pull-up jump shot, you know. So uh, we understand how, how heartbreaking that is, and we don't want to feel that feeling again. Here are the deepest runs Tennessee has made in the NCAA tournament in its history. The Vols have never been to the Final Four. The 2010 team, coached by Bruce Pearl, reached the Elite Eight before losing to Michigan State by one point. Tennessee has made seven trips to the Sweet 16, most recently in 2014, and this is the 22nd time that the Vols have gone to the big dance. They've been a number two seed twice before. In 2006, they lost to Wichita State in the second round, and in 2008, Tennessee went to the Sweet 16 before losing to three seed Louisville. The Vols have won both NCAA tournament games they've played in Columbus, Ohio in the past. That's where they will play on Friday. For more on the opponent, we go to Luis Fernandez. It's time to meet the Colgate Raiders. At 24 and 10 this season, Colgate is in the NCAA tournament because they beat Bucknell in the Patriot League championship game. It's what you would expect from a number 15 seed. A lot of wins against teams in its conference, but Colgate has lost to some bad major programs this year, like Syracuse, Penn State, and Pitt. One thing that is a little troubling for the Vols, Colgate is one of the best three-point shooting teams in the country. The Raiders are hitting 38.3% of their shots from downtown. Colgate is on a program record 11-game winning streak. During that stretch, the Raiders are shooting 47.8% from three. Tennessee and Colgate have actually met twice. The last game was in 1960. The Vols are 0-2 in those contests. The good news is two seeds are 128 and eight all time against 15 seeds in the NCAA tournament. The last upset was 2016. Michigan State lost to MTSU. That'll do it from Nashville. I'll go ahead and send it back to you.